What is the update that we have been waiting to share for weeks as Grayson Manning, the 12 year old Slidell boy who was hit by a truck on Father's Day is finally at home. WDSU is at Children's Hospital this morning as Grayson, his mom, his grandpa, his friends all marked this milestone. His mother telling me that she is just humbled by the show of support and it's kept her and him going all this time. Nearly 11 weeks after being rolled into Children's Hospital, New Orleans. I mean, it's just, it's a miracle. It is a miracle. Grayson Manning is walking out. He set his own kind of targets and, and met them so quickly. It has been a roller coaster of a journey since Grayson was hit by a truck on Father's Day. His mother, in her first interview with WDSU, wasn't sure about his future, but knew her son was determined, and so was she. So I told the rehab team my goal is, I actually think I said, like, we're not leaving until he's walking. And then in the beginning, they were even like, well, you just might want to set some reasonable expectations. Don't know if that'll be able to happen. Um, but I had it in my mind. I think Grayson had it in his mind. And Grayson proved that on his road to recovery, even walking unassisted in the hospital days before getting discharged. He definitely found his own path. We do a, a really good job of facilitating how we want him to progress, and he found his own way to kind of make that work. Grayson has met so many friends and touched countless lives along the way. I think you go into healthcare because you want to help people. So coming from seeing the kid laying in the bed and watching him walk out is just a wonderful feeling. So it was a tough goodbye. We have been in this little bubble of a of, of hospital family. We've gotten to know everybody here. It's been um, it's become like a little home. The silver lining on this cloudy day is Grayson, always proving to be a shining light for those who meet him. And this family has felt that love in return. The most surprising thing is how much like, humanity has kind of shown its positive side because we get um, letters of support and cards from strangers every day. And that has actually kept me going throughout this. Um, I've never actually in my life, I think, felt so much love than I have during this process. We are so happy that he's back home. And hey, here's some good medicine for any 12 year old to hear video games. Yeah, because Grayson's left hand still needs to kind of strengthen his little a little bit. His rehab team is all for the PlayStation right now. So Grayson, if you're watching, play that PlayStation. Grayson and his mom did make it home just fine today and they are ready to embark on this next chapter.